If you've been on the sidelines, if you've been observing, but you haven't been involved, this is actually your moment to get involved. Social movements give people the hope and the belief that everyday people that come together can transform their reality. My name is Maurice Mitchell. I am the National Director of the Working Families Party, and I support Senator Elizabeth Warren for president. We're creating a grassroots party in waiting for the grassroots movement that wants true justice. I saw from very early on what it meant to struggle, the realities of the race, class, and gender barriers that face working people every single day. I wanted to be involved in struggles to eliminate those barriers and to change those structures, both here and around the world, so that everyday people can not just survive, but thrive. When I knock on doors, when I see people on the street, and I meet people, there's something really amazing that's happening in this country. People are ready for big structural change. And Elizabeth Warren's campaign from day one has been about focusing on the structures of our economy and our democracy, calling out the corruption that holds them in place. She often talks about the fact that she has a plan for this and a plan for that, right? But when you look at the substance of her plans, she weaves together plans that speak to the unique experience of people. And if we don't look at people's specific differences, there's no way that we could deal specifically with their conditions. Elizabeth Warren actually sees us, sees our identity, sees the fact that there is difference, and that difference is actually a beautiful aspect of our society. And so when it comes to environmental justice and Senator Warren's plans around environmental justice, it's clear that she listened and has continued to listen to frontline communities because our environment is not this abstract thing. It's about saving our lives. It's about saving our communities to make sure that the next generation has a better life and can actually thrive. We will have a commander in chief who sees it as her duty to wake up every day and be accountable to working families.